Okay, Michael. I'd just like you to take this. If you'd have a little look, and as you see, there's a playing card, a prediction. Just place that to one side. Yeah. Okay. I've got a pack of cards. Regular deck. Now, just in case you think it's in any particular order, just cut it a few times. Um, so it's, there's no way that I can know what, what order the cards are in. Yeah. Right. I want you to take the cards, pick them up, and I want you to deal them into a pile, face up, just one at a time. Okay. And whenever you feel like it, you just stop. You happy with that, yeah? Yep. You want to go any further? Yep. No. Right, now, you might think there's some way that I could have known that you're going to stop on that card, or there's some way that I could have worked it out. But what we're going to do is we're going to use whatever the next card is as an indicator card. So say it was an 8 or a 10 or something, we'll count that many cards down, and again, we'll arrive at a totally random card. So have a look and see what the card is. The card is, in fact, a 6. So I want you to deal another 6 cards down. 2, 3, 4, 5... This is the sixth card. And if it had been a seven, what would the card have been? It would have been, a, it would have been the Queen of Diamonds. But we've stopped on this card. OK. If you take your prediction, take that out of the wallet. There you go. If you just turn that over, we'll see it was the Three of Hearts. And the actual card that you stopped on was also the Three of Hearts. Well done.